gunfighters from various squadrons across base had their readiness put to the test during exercise Gunslinger 18-4. The exercise allowed personnel and units to assess their ability to execute the 366 Spider Wing mission in a contested environment. The Wing Inspector General team was responsible for putting together the large-scale exercise. Wing Inspector Technical Sergeant Dustin Mayo describes the scenarios units faced. Some of the scenarios that the gunfighters faced was the ability to survive and operate in a seaburn environment. Seaburn means chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear. By being able to operate in these environments, we definitely made our gunfighters ready. The scenarios were developed from subject matter experts in each squadron to ensure readiness objectives were being met in various areas. Staff Sergeant Carlos Olivares recounts his experience inspecting maintenance airmen on their execution of self-aid buddy care techniques during the exercise. As an IG wit inspector, uh, we go around the flight line and all the back shops and every single building anything to do with the maintenance group and we go inspect them to make sure they're wearing the proper gear, uh, they don their equipment in the right amount of time, that everyone's being safe, and uh, we also uh, make sure that they can perform all the self-aid buddy care on any type of injuries for anything that can happen in the situations. You know, we simulated an airman got electrocuted and uh, fell unconscious, and uh, two airmen uh, jumped at the scene and rendered self-aid buddy care and did a really good job of doing it. The 366 Fighter Wing Commander Colonel Joe Kunkel explains the importance of large-scale readiness exercises like Gunslinger 18-4. This exercise is extremely important, not only in being able to survive, but also operate, because we want to be able to continue to take the fight to the enemy, regardless of the circumstances, regardless of the conditions, regardless of enemy action. So this exercise proves our ability to do that. Lessons learned during the exercise allows the wing to continue to provide combat air power to today's global challenges. Senior Airman Sataya Burton, Mountain Home Air Force Base, Idaho.